As the water rises, the evil is vanishing from the lake. Link, you did it! <sighs> Creepy, stupid fish. You marry me? <laughs> oh, Sheik, it's... Hey, she said thanks or something. Did Ruto want to thank me? I see. We have to return peace to Hyrule for her sake, too, don't we? Yeah, I don't know. She's kind of creepy. Look at that, Link. Together, you and Princess Ruto destroyed the evil monster. Nah, pretty sure I did that on my own, buddy. Once again, the lake is filled with pure water. All is as as it was. Yeah, there's the bridge, the thing, the pedophile's house. Yeah, all is well. It's beautiful and pretty. So, reading good books lately? Oh, I love your hair, man. Have you, have you ever taken time just to like, gaze at the... Uh, uh, can't, can't find, find me. me. Dude, what the heck, man? I'm tired of you leaving. Nah, 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 boo boo. Come on, man. This isn't funny. I want to see your face. See you in hell! What? The heck was that? Psst, stupid chic. Ooh, I'm awesome. Look at me. I can go away really quickly. Oh, he makes me so mad. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take it out on the sun. It's all your fault. Whoa, 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 whoa. What did I just do? No, what? I'm, I'm sorry. Holy crap. It looks like the ice that was, um... Covering King Zora, doesn't it? But that can't be ice. I shot the sun. It has to be something flammable. Let's check it out. What do we have? We got the fire arrow! Now we can power up and inflame our arrows and burn stuff. It's much quicker than stupid dense fire. Okay, so before we head on with our quest, we're going to briefly go back and visit the fishing pond. Now, right away you might think, oh god, fishing again. But don't worry, I'm actually not going to show much of this. And there's not really a whole lot we have to do. Don't worry, it's not going to take very long. Uh, the first thing I need to do is I need to catch a fish. And if we can catch a fish that's like 12 pounds or higher, or something like that, uh, we can get an upgrade, uh, so I'm going to do that. Um, I've read different sources. I read something that said 12 pounds. I read something that said 15 pounds. I believe it's 12 pounds. I think it has to be 12 pounds or higher. And I've even read some stuff that says it just has to be higher than your previous record. So basically, in order to get this upgrade, you want to strive to catch a really big fish. So I would just try to do that. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into the fishing pond here. I'm going to catch a fish, and I'm not going to show any of that, but when I actually catch the fish, that's the footage I'm going to show. Okay? So let's off-screen to where I'm catching the fish. I'll see you guys then. Oh, man, that was tough to catch that. There we go. A real lunker indeed. It's 13 pounds. Okay, that sounds good enough to me. So, let's go turn this into the fishing guy. Whoa! That fish is huge. It looks like a new record. It weighs at least 13 pounds. Seriously. Okay, here's your prize. And we got the awesome golden scale! Now we can swim deeper in the water. Amazing. And I know exactly how to celebrate getting this thing. What? What? What are you doing to me? <laughs> Hold on. Ha <laughs> ha, you're bald. <laughs> He's bald. <laughs> you're like Caillou. <laughs> He's freaking bald. Okay, that's enough of that. Alright, let's, just for fun, let's throw your head out there. Haha, <laughs> that'll teach you to charge me 20 rupees. Alright, so now the last thing I'm going to show is this item called the Sinking Lure. Uh... If you look around the fishing pond, eventually you'll come across an item called the Sinking Lure, which can help you fish much easier. Um, it's usually in random spots, sometimes it's along the wall, sometimes it's somewhere in the rocks, sometimes it's in the lily pad, 
Mine was over here, near these rocks in the back. And you get the sinking lure. And you have the option to keep it or throw it away. I'm going to use it and demonstrate it. Now with the sinking lure, when you use the sinking lure, it'll go deep into the water like this. And you can get a closer look at the water. And this will allow you to catch fish much easier. Now the problem with this, though, is that this is considered cheating in the fishing pond. So, if you do this and you catch a fish, he won't count it and it'll he'll say you're disqualified. So, it's kind of pointless really to use it. But, that'll do it for the fishing pond. And now let's move on, and because we've got bigger fish to fry. <laughs> Alright, I'm in front of the laboratory here. Uh, we've been here a couple of times. I'm going to get a very quick heart piece that I can get now that I've got the golden scale. But once you get the golden scale, you can dive down a total of 8 feet instead of 6. So if you come in here in the laboratory and d simply dive all the way to the bottom floor, and you can only do this when you get the golden scale, because if you have the silver scale, you can't dive that deep. Well, after you simply dive down that deep, uh, this guy... Uh, Jafar in disguise is going to be impressed. You may have not noticed, but I've been watching you. You touched the bottom just now. Fantastic. I'll give this to you. And you get a heart piece from him. Uh, he gave me his reward. His eternal reward. Okay. Well, now let's move on to Kakeriko Village. Our next stop. Alright. Heading towards Kakeriko Village. I've already been here like 20 times, so I didn't feel any need to show any of that. So let's go to the wonderful Kikariko... Uh-oh, what? Someone's having a barbecue, I think. Somebody leave the coffee pot on again. Oh, man. The house of Skatula's on fire. Dude, don't tell me I got all those Skatula's for nothing. Oh, man. Uh-oh, there's Sheik. What's he up to? Let's find out. Oh, he's making a wish. How sweet. Get back, Link! <laughs> well, you've got back, that's for sure. <laughs> Alright, dude, I'll let you make your wish and... Dude, did you wish for the well to blow up? Man, that's not a nice wish. No, you didn't? What did you wish for, then? Oh! You wished to fly! Okay, that's what you wished for. Okay. Oh, Gotta step up those flying skills, buddy. Oh. Dude. Why would you wish for that, man? You don't wish for freaking... They took Grimace and grinded him up. And... terrible dream that this idiot made a wish and oh crap looks, looks like, like you're, you're coming, coming around. around the mountain link, link. A, terrible a terrible thing, thing has happened. happened the evil, evil shadow, shadow spirit has been released, released. Empa, Empa, the leader of the character village, village had sealed the evil shadow spirit in the bottom of the well but the force, the force of the of evil spirit got so strong the seal of the well broke and escaped, escaped into, into the, the world. world. I believe Empa has gone to the Shadow, Shadow, Temple, Shadow Temple, Temple to seal it again, but she'll be in danger without any help. Link! Empa is one of the six sages. Destroy this evil Shadow Spirit and save Empa! There is an entrance to the Shadow Temple, beneath the graveyard behind this village. The only thing I can do for you is teach you the melody that will lead you to the Shadow Temple. This is the melody that will draw you into the infinite darkness that absorbs even, yeah, time, of course. Listen to this, the Noxure in a Shadow. Pull it out of my butt.
Let me take care of the village. I'm counting on you, Link. Ah, just kidding. You're on your own, buddy. They say when the shadow spirit sees his shadow, it means there's six weeks of rain. <laughs>